they say that the world of finance is a harsh and unforgiving place. But in reality, these claims are only meant to intimidate those who are looking to make their fortune. Anyone can amass millions of dollars in his or her bank account with the right knowledge and a commitment to the rules of wealth. In this video, we'll be unlocking the secret to having big money by teaching you fundamentals to wealth. One of the first people to become the richest person in human history was Andrew Carnegie, and he is a prime example of this. What did he do to achieve such success? And how can we apply his principles today to become even richer? If you want to know the answers to all your finance-related questions, be sure to watch this video until the end. Your journey to wealth will start by clicking subscribe. Andrew Carnegie was born in 1835 to a humble family in Scotland. His parents, determined to give their children a better life, decided to immigrate to the United States and settled near Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. At a young age, Andrew was forced to take a job as a coiler in a spinning mill, despite only having completed fifth grade of education. He worked long hours, and his days seemed never-ending. But Andrew never lost sight of his dream to one day be successful. He was determined to make something of himself and improve his life, so he worked hard and saved every penny he could. Despite his humble beginnings, Andrew Carnegie went on to become one of the wealthiest businessmen in human history. Inspired by his journey from poverty to success, he laid out his own set of rules to guide aspiring entrepreneurs. This is your chance to follow in his footsteps and build your career step by step. With Andrew Carnegie's help, you can turn your ambitions into reality. Fabulous. So without further ado. Number 10. Indulge your imagination. Carnegie said, dare to think beyond what has already been done. He was encouraging people to take a chance, to be creative, and to stretch their imagination. He believed that the only limits to success were those you put on yourself. So why not take Carnegie's advice and start indulging your imagination? It's one of the most important tools you have to help you achieve your financial goals. It can help you find creative solutions to problems, come up with innovative ideas, and even open the door to new opportunities. It can also help you identify potential risks and come up with strategies to mitigate them. But more than that, it can bring your dreams to life. So don't be afraid to use your imagination. Take the time to think beyond what's already been done. You never know what you might discover. You could find the secret of wealth and receive big money. Number 9. Go the Extra Mile In his book, The Law of Success in 16 Lessons, Carnegie emphasizes the importance of doing more than what is necessary. He states, Doing more than you have to do is the only thing that justifies raises or promotions and puts people under an obligation to you. It's the old saying, Go the extra mile, it's never crowded. Going that extra mile is an investment in yourself. It shows that you are willing to put in the extra effort required to be successful. You are motivated and determined to reach your goals. It also sets you apart from the competition and demonstrates your commitment to excellence. It's not easy to go the extra mile, especially when it's not required of you. You have to be willing to put in the extra time, energy, and effort. It can also be disheartening when your extra effort goes unnoticed, but it's important to stay focused on the long-term benefits. Going the extra mile isn't just about doing more work, it's about doing the best work. By taking the time to do things the right way the first time, you'll save yourself time down the line. You'll also be able to complete tasks in a more efficient and organized manner, which will make your work look more impressive. Going the extra mile also applies to the way you treat people. Show your coworkers, customers, and clients that you care about them and their success. Show them that you are willing to go the extra mile to ensure their satisfaction. Going the extra mile is an essential part of earning big money. It's a sign that you are committed to achieving success and are willing to put in the extra work required to get there. Number 8. Create a Mastermind Alliance Andrew claimed that the only secret of wealth is to surround yourself with people with similar purpose and optimism. 
So, what does this mean for you? Well, a big part of achieving success is having the right support system. When you are surrounded by people who share the same goals, you can use their motivation and knowledge to help you reach yours. Having the right people around you can even lift you up when you are feeling down. It is also important to note that optimism is key to success. Number 7. Practice. Applied Faith. Carnegie. The secret of success lies not in luck or destiny, but in action. At the heart of this advice is a concept of applied faith, believing in yourself and your purpose so fully that you act with complete confidence. To put it simply, if you want to receive big money, you need to have faith in what you're doing and take action. The great thing about applied faith is that it works for everyone, regardless of your current financial situation. You can start right now, and create a new reality for yourself. All it takes is a shift in your mindset and the confidence to take action. The key is to start small. Instead of focusing on the outcome, focus on the process. It might mean committing to a budget or learning a new skill. Whatever it is, keep at it and make sure you're taking small steps towards your goals every day. As you take consistent action, you'll start to build momentum and increase your faith in yourself and your abilities. You'll start to see the results of your hard work, and this will give you the confidence to keep going. At the same time, don't forget to enjoy the journey. There's nothing wrong with having fun and celebrating your successes. As long as you stay disciplined and keep taking action, you'll see the results of applied faith and start to receive big money. Number 6. Have Personal Initiative Carnegie. Having initiative means taking the initiative and doing what needs to be done without being told. It's about being proactive and taking charge of your own success. It's about having the ability to think ahead, set goals, and take action to achieve them. Having personal initiative can mean the difference between success and failure when it comes to creating wealth. When you have initiative, you are more likely to take on challenges and find creative solutions. You are also more likely to develop a good work ethic and stay motivated. Having initiative also means taking personal responsibility for your finances. It means being creative and finding new ways to make your money work for you. Having initiative can also help you build relationships that can help you achieve your financial goals. Finally, having initiative can help you stay focused on the big picture. It means staying focused on your long-term goals and taking action to make them a reality. Number 5. Exert Enthusiasm Carnegie was a firm believer in the power of enthusiasm, and his success is a testament to how important it is. He wrote in his autobiography, I have learned that success is not measured by the amount of money you make, but by the enthusiasm you have for what you do. And he was right. Enthusiasm is infectious, and can be the difference between success and failure. It's the energy and optimism that you bring to your work that will help you achieve your goals. But it's not just about having a good attitude. It's also about being proactive and taking ownership of your work. When you're enthusiastic about something, you're more likely to take the initiative and push yourself to do more. Enthusiasm can also help you build relationships. It radiates from you and makes you more attractive to potential employers and clients. People are drawn to those who have an optimistic outlook and a can-do attitude. In addition to the professional benefits, enthusiasm can also make you happier. A positive outlook can help you feel more satisfied with your work and can help you to stay motivated. Number 4. Think Accurately It's no secret that Carnegie was a master of wealth creation and management, but what was his secret? The answer is simple, accuracy. Accuracy is the key to success in any financial endeavor. When it comes to investing, it's important to have a clear and precise plan in place before you commit to any investments, so you know where your money is going. This is something that Carnegie was an expert in, and something that he passed on to those who followed in his footsteps. Whether you're investing in stocks, bonds, mutual funds or other financial instruments, accuracy is key. You need to understand the risks involved before investing, 
and make sure that you're comfortable with the risks. Knowing the exact amount of money that you have saved, investments that you have made, debts that you have, and the overall financial picture of your life can help you make wise decisions about how you manage your money. Number 3. Concentrate your effort. The secret to becoming wealthy is to focus on one thing and make it a priority. The problem with concentrating your efforts is that it's easier said than done. We live in a world that's filled with distractions, and it's hard to stay focused on one thing. You might find yourself trying to do too many things at once, and not achieving any lasting success. To become wealthy, you need to become laser-focused on your goal. You need to be able to ignore the distractions, and focus on the task at hand. This might mean saying, no, to more social activities, or taking a break from Netflix. Remember, Carnegie was once a nobody that became one of the wealthiest people to ever live. He did this by concentrating his efforts, and staying focused on his goals. He was unafraid to make tough decisions, and sacrifice his time in order to become successful. This is the same approach you need to take if you want to become wealthy. While it's tempting to try, and do everything at once, it's important to take it one step at a time. Concentrate your efforts, and stay focused on the task at hand, and you'll be on your way to achieving your goals. Number 2. Profit from Adversity If you ever wanted to know the secret of wealth, and make big money, then you need to know the story of Andrew Carnegie, and his workers. In 1882, Carnegie owned one of the biggest steel mills in the United States. His workers were devoted to their work and Carnegie was reaping the rewards. So, when he decided to cut their wages, they weren't too pleased. Despite their protests, Carnegie went ahead and reduced their wages. The workers at the steel mill decided to go on strike in response. The strike lasted for more than two months, and it involved more than 12,000 workers. In the end, the strikes weren't successful, and the workers had to accept the wage cuts. But despite the workers' protests, Carnegie still became one of the wealthiest men in the world. Well, the secret is that Carnegie was a brilliant businessman who was adept at investing. He invested in railroads, wool, and steel companies, and he was able to make a fortune. He was also an advocate of philanthropy, and gave away millions of dollars to charity. It seemed that Carnegie had found the secret to wealth, but what was it? Number 1. Set a clear purpose. Carnegie. The only secret of wealth is to set a clear purpose for it. So, what does this mean? Well, it means that to make big money, you need to have a clear purpose in mind. This could be anything from starting a business to investing in the stock market, or even simply saving for retirement. No matter what your purpose is, it's important to have a plan in place, and to stick to it. When it comes to setting a clear purpose for your wealth, it's important to have a few key things in mind. First, it's important to have realistic goals and expectations. Ask yourself what you want to achieve and what resources you have to get there. Then, create a plan of action and break it down into manageable steps. Second, it's important to be patient and consistent. You won't get rich overnight and there will be ups and downs along the way. But if you stay consistent, and keep your eye on the prize, you will eventually achieve the wealth you desire. Finally, it's important to remember to be thankful for what you have. Having a clear purpose for your wealth, and taking the necessary steps to achieve it is great, but don't forget to be grateful for what you already have. Andrew Carnegie had come a long way. From a humble family in Scotland to one of the most influential businessmen of all time, Andrew's life story is an example of determination and hard work. His success was a testament to the power of hard work and the importance of never giving up on one's dreams.